Hey everyone, it's Dan, it's Almost Everything 84. Today I have a review of the SunnyTech Hot Air Sterling Engine. I'm a huge fan of the SunnyTech products already. Uh, I find that all the engines and some of the other items are really high quality and it's really a relief to be able to, you know, perhaps buy for yourself or if sharing with your family or even from an educational standpoint to not have to spend hundreds of dollars in order to get some of these things. Um, you know, and, and, and you've seen probably the prices at some of the traditional models in the States. So anyway, um, what we basically have here today is the two cylinders, the hot and the cold, and the exchange that creates this to work, and it's going to power an LED light. So I'm using 99% um, uh, alcohol here. I tried 90% first. I didn't like it. It's just how hot it's going to burn and how fast you can get this thing going. So I filled it up already. And I'm going to place that right in the designated holder. And we're going to get it going. We're going to let that burn a little bit. Now with the 99%, it does, uh, it does heat up rather quickly. And, uh, and you can get this thing going pretty, pretty quick. Another thing I'll mention um, is that it does come with some spare parts as well. So you see that this glass cylinder right here, it has an extra one of those. And there's little rubber kind of O-rings in there that when you slide this piece on, when you first get the set, that it gives you extra ones too. So that's that's great. I think there's also an extra wick uh, for when you you know, you know burn this wick out. So I was pretty happy that it, it did come with that because uh, it's hard to find these parts, especially around here, uh, if you need to do replacements. So this thing's been uh, burning for a little bit now. Give it a little test. In order to get this started, you do need to spin the flywheel Nope. So that's that's what you get when you're using that hot of an alcohol level. So pretty much spin real good. It's got some good shape to it with this one with the wood base. Let me give that a stop. Go the other way. There we go. Kind of hold it down a little bit. And now we're pumped, we're firing probably as fast as we can go. And the light will change all different colors, as you could see, based on the speed. I'm going to blow that out for a second. And then it'll kind of continue on for a little as the heat dissipates. But overall, I'd say um, I'm really happy with this. I definitely recommend it if you're looking for this type of engine. And I think it, it's it's a great example um, to show kids or, or even a, you know, a class of students. So hope this helps you make your decision. And um, have a great day. Thanks.